Hello everybody, my name is Steven and welcome to another Pixel for Life video tutorial. So today we're going to be doing another programming lesson. It's going to be something pretty quick and easy. Um, and then I promise we're going to be doing some more design ones. I just haven't done much design lately, more, more programming, so that's kind of what my mindset is. Um, so today, it's just going to be a quick tutorial. What we're going to be doing is creating a HTML uh, redirect. So uh, I was I had the idea to learn Tumblr, and I just wanted to poke my nose into it and see what it was like to create a custom theme. So the best way to learn is by doing. So I made a quick portfolio right over here. You can check it out, become my fan or whatever it is. Um, follow me, and it's just a quick portfolio, uh, completely designed by me. So what I want to happen is I want to have it redirect to this page when I go to skbcg.com. Now Tumblr has a, its own redirect thing where you can host it on your domain, but you have to change the name servers and whatnot. It gets a little complex, and I really didn't want to do that. I wanted something that I can quickly change at the spur of the moment, and the best way to do that is to do a quick HTML redirect. So if you're unclear of what we're going to be doing, it's just simply this. When I go to skbcg.com, it automatically redirects me to .tumblr.com. All right. So just a couple lines of code. I'm gonna pop up Coda 2. Hopefully this font size is big enough for you. And I have a basic HTML5 structure. And I'm just going to give it a quick title of skbcg. I don't know. Temp portfolio. Whatever. And then underneath here is where the magic is going to happen. So we're going to create a simple meta tag. And then we're going to go HTTP uh, dash EQUIV. Equiv equals refresh. So what this means is that as soon as the page loads, refresh it. And then we're going to have it do the following thing. So it's going to refresh the page. And then for content, equals and we're gonna put uh, zero that means uh, wait zero seconds before doing this and it's going to be uh, URL equals and this is where we're gonna put our URL uh, URL HTTP colon slash slash and then skbcg dot dot com alright so let me just ex go over that one more time just explaining what happens um, so the first thing is as soon as the page loads it's going to refresh it and then wait zero seconds and then redirect it to um, skbcg.tumblr.com so uh, that, that right there you can get away with that but this option this meta tag right here can be disabled by the user so you want to have a manual way to get to the website and for that I'm sure you've seen this before we're just going to create a quick uh, paragraph tag and in here I'm going to write um, you are being, uh, being directed to my temporary tumblr portfolio if you're not redirected within a couple of seconds click here and then we're going to We'll just break that. Oops. Just a quick break tag and then a href equals http colon the same the same link is up here. So I'm just gonna copy this. Paste it. And then we'll just give it a title of SKBCG Tumblr portfolio. And close that off. All right, so let's save that, and then I'm gonna quickly upload it. So I saved it right here on my desktop. I'm gonna quickly upload it onto my server. Overwrite what's there existing already, and I named it index.html, so it's the file that gets read um, when you go to skbcg. So let's try that again. Click it, boom, gets refreshed. Beautiful. All right, and there you go. That's all there is to it. So that's the quick and easy way to have it automatically redirect um, one domain to another 
domain or another page on your website, whatever. Uh, and really nice for if you're using Tumblr. That way you don't have to change your name servers and go through all the crazy steps. Simple and easy. Hope you learned something new and that you're able to apply it to your own life. Thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe and let me know if you have any tutorial ideas. Um, yep, that's going to end this. Thanks for watching. See you next time.